Hello, uh, Kyoku here, with, yes, with, um, my plushie of Kyoku, my persona. I just wanted to show a project I started in 2019, kind of back when I was traveling around and job hunting and stuff. It was like way at the beginning of 2019, and I eventually kind of just stopped it. And my intention was to finish this whole notebook with the project, but... I got fairly far and then never did. And I don't know if I'm gonna give up and use this for other stuff or if I'm gonna kinda leave it dedicated to that and maybe open it up later. I think I might, but I don't know. But I just wanted to show you, basically the idea was I was doing a bunch of um, anime or pseudo anime style, mostly headshots. All of them were free for Sona requests. Um, and it just, yeah, that was the main idea. So I just kind of wanted to, um, thumb through them with you here. Let's see. Is that? Yeah, that works. So, just gonna kind of show you the picture and then I guess I have on the back the name and the date. So this is the first one as you can see. And I played around with doing just pen sketches, or none sometimes, or ink outlines like this one has, or paint outlines, and like no pencil outlines, or just different things, but mostly it was staying in, you know, anime style, mostly headshots. And this is also before I started using white pen highlighter, so you're not going to see any of that. And it was before I had um, my pearlescent paints, so they're all going to be fairly solid colors, but, yeah. Oh, and the very first page is a paint swatch, and it says Kyoku, and my phone number. So this is Midnight Dragon's OC Deathless, and it was done on 1 slash 4 slash 19. This one was an anglerfish um, OC, I remember, so I thought that was pretty cool. Um, and I know I think he was actually like a friendly one mostly, despite kind of looking scary, but yeah, he was kind of cool. Um, and this is uh, Damien Voidscale's Sona, and this was done 1 4 19. So here we have a dragon, and this is. Natalie D's OC. Wait, this also says Deathless. Um, was there two named that, or did I write something wrong? I am slightly confused now, but maybe there was. Um, and that says 1 slash 4 slash 19. Here we have this cute doggo. And this is Kingio's Sona. Also 1 slash 4 slash 19. You can see here this, um, I think it's a wolf that was uh, controller inspired, like a game controller. Um, and this was Infrared Nexus's OC Gizmo. I believe he also has a dragon OC. It's been a while since I've seen him on Fur Affinity um, forums, but. I remember that user. Um, I think I think it was he him, but pronouns, but I'm not 100% positive. Oh, and that was one slash five slash nineteen. Now uh, this was someone's request to draw their dog, so it's a little different, but it still kind of has big chibi eyes <laughs> and um, just pencil outlines. begging for food. This is Mother Anubis's dog Sheena, and I don't have a date on that one. Um, this was a drawing I did for Pride Week for a certain character, so that's why their hair is dyed and they have the jewelry and stuff on. Um, or it was for like their Pride celebration. Or maybe it's during Pride Month. I don't remember if it was for a specific Pride Salvation where they live. Actually, 
Yeah, it was it was Pride Month. And I think they um showed different outfits and things their character wear and talk I mean, wears and talks about different things and stuff like that. So I think I kind of decided to go with that for them. And this one is also um, this one's interesting because I was trying to do like rainbow painted outlines and I guess you can decide whether you think that worked or not. But um, this person's character actually, um, I think at some point they came out as trans and actually got new art of um, their character kind of transitioning with them from various people. So that was pretty cool. I think that was after this point, but um, yeah. So this is uh, Consex Sona. I'm thinking of a different cow, but I'm pretty, pretty positive it was the same one. Um, and that was at one slash six slash nineteen. Here we have this picture, kind of looking down a little bit with the shadow <laughs> and like the smirk. Um, and this is. Sapphire Wolf Sona, who's also just named Sapphire, and I presume a wolf. <laughs> this was 1 slash 6 slash 19. Oh wait, I am out of it. Yeah, that wouldn't have been Pride Month, that would have for the other one, but I think, um, yeah, I just, um, did it for, like, a Pride event for them, I think. Um, or drew the character going to Pride with their hair dye and whatnot. This is a really cool um, dragon. It looks like it has like the asexual flag colors. I don't know if that was the intention, but it's pretty neat. And this is Axel Wolf's um, Sona. Apparently I wrote new Sona, <laughs> so I guess they just got it, and it's Parma. The eye colors aren't um, ace, so they might not have intended it, but Possibly. It's a pretty neat dragon design. Um, this is um, someone's character, which, if I remember, is supposed to be their fursona's daughter, I believe. And I think she's like part demon and part um, wolf, I think. Um, I believe the mother was the demon in like their story or whatever. So that was something they were interested in having drawn. And so this is Battle Fox Foxo's um Sona's daughter. Yep, that's what I wrote. And then it's one seven nineteen. Here's a cute little pupper. And this is Kitty Cat 805's OC. I don't have a date written on it. I've done a few different pieces of work for this person. I believe um, Belladonna Mandrake was their name. And it's like a cycloptic, psychic jackalope. It's a pretty cool character design. I like seeing them around. Yeah, it's, it is Belladonna Mandrake, and the OC's name is Claire the Jackalope. So here's um, this um, character that's like a tinker kangaroo. Can't remember their name offhand. Um, just oh, it's just Kanga. <laughs> yep, and that was one slash eleven slash nineteen. And we have this cloaked character here. I believe it was a wolf. I think. I remember doing this in a random coffee shop and then someone coming up to me and being like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> so it's, it's kind of interesting when someone just kind of does that out of nowhere. Um, and so this was Ricky Six Guns OC. I don't have the OC's name right in here. And that's 1 slash 11 slash 19. Here we have a Chibi Kitsune. So this one wasn't a headshot, but it was very chibi. You can see the little body and the giant tails, so this was fun and kind of a different style than I normally do or even normally kind of manage to do, so I'm happy this kind of 
like this, how this came out. Um, I always love doing um, kitsunes and other yokai. Um, Kyoku likes meeting other yokai and um, having like yokai events and stuff. So, super cool. And this is Ristrin's Sona. Let's see, here we have um, this, I, I think, dragon, but it looks a ton like a Shoiru from Neopets. Um, yeah, it is a dragon. Sky, Drigner's Sona, 114, 19. And this one we have kind of chibi and sleeping on a pillow. <laughs> I believe this is like a made up creature, kind of like a catish, dragonish creature. It's pretty cute. This is Rosie Paws OC Acacia? I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. And it was 115.19. So here's a character, I tried doing a different pose, like him kind of scratching his chin and thinking. Damn, I've gotten worse at doing dynamic poses since then. I mean, not that these are super dynamic, but I think I've been going even more static than I was in this project. And I think that trying to do different anime faces specifically got me branching out a little bit. So it's cool that I kind of did this with this focus and it wouldn't be a terrible thing to go back to. Um, this is Kori Sona. Spelled K-O-U-R-I-I. Yeah, so Kori. And that's 115.19. Here we have this um, light colored wolfish character with uh, just sort of pencil lines as the outlines. Which I thought kind of worked with the colors. I mean, except for on the eyes, that's outlined in paint. And this is Caratine's OC, which is 116.19. Um, and we have this cool lion here. Um, this is Moonshadow 2's Lion Sona. <laughs> A little fox going blip, blip. <laughs> and um, lots of fluff going down their back and on their head. So given the floofs there, I don't remember if they were part something else or if they were 100% fox, but there you go. I think the hair looks pretty cool on this one. And this is Marcel's OC Marcel. <laughs> yeah, here we have a pretty neat um, wolf, I believe, with I, th I think a cybernetic eye. It's a kind of cool style. Like, I mean, or at least like stylistic choices with the way they kind of have the um, cheek fluff and stuff going down and kind of just the look to it. Um, this is Raspberry 27 Sona Mad Mad Dog Merrick. And this is 119 2019. Here we have another dragon. Pretty cool. Um, and this is Diamond Creators. Oh, it's an Orca Dragon. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Pretty cool. Um and I painted I put the note to remember for some reason that I painted this during a flight, so probably to an interview. So that's kind of neat. That was 1 slash 21 slash 19. Um, so here we have, I think, like a shark alien of some sort. It's pretty cool. I like the antennae and like the back fin and stuff. Um, <laughs> and this is Atlas Delta's OC. That's 1 slash 22 slash 19. Here we have a dinosaur. I forget what type of dinosaur the long neck dinos are. Um, that's a cutie. You don't really see too many. Like, you see some dinosaurs, but you don't see too many of those. Um, 
And this is Littlefoot 505 Zosi Durango Thunder Thunderfoot. <laughs> and this is 1 slash 21 E2 slash 19. Super cute character. Uh -oh. So here we have this kind of neat uh, wolf, I think. <laughs> This is Jix OC Envy, and that was 1 slash 23 slash 19. And this was um, a character that I've actually designed for a close friend of mine um, who we've. Um, it's a friend I've actually lost. Um, but yeah, so this was a, a drawing of um, like the first one I made of them. So this is Cybear. And that was one uh, 2319. Let's see. And then this is. I'm not entirely sure what they were. <laughs> Let's see. Inferno X's Sona Inferno. Two five uh, nineteen. And we got this neat creature, and that's Playfire Marks Twos OC. This is two eleven nineteen. Um, so this one's kind of interesting. So this is Universe actually, um, from kind of art of them at the time, they had of them at the time. Um, and if you've seen my first Mystery Envelope video, then you recognize this character. But it's like very different than all the drawings I've done of them and all the artwork I've done of them in that. So it's kind of neat to see how that changed. And this was 2.11.19. Um, I'm not entirely sure what this creature is. This is Powlite's Shapeshifter OC. That's neat. And this is 2.11.19. Um, this one was a smaller drawing. I think it's a Tiger Fox. And this is KZ King's OC Kate. I could be entirely wrong. That was a guess. I, I'm not sure I remember what they were. So here's a wolf that I like how that came out. And this is Dat Wolf's Sona. <laughs> um, in 2-18-19, and it's called D-A-T. <laughs> yep. <laughs> kind of funny. So here's kind of a cute, expressive anime face. Lots of shiny. <laughs> And this is Ranso C. Uh, Rayleigh Monia. I might be saying that wrong. And this is 218. Here we have a sleepy bat, I think. <laughs> Probably a fruit bat. Uh, Weary Bones OC Bartleby. That's a cute name. And that's 2 slash 23 slash 19. And that's the last page I got to. So we got this left. Here, I'll show you kind of that chunk there. So a good bit of space, but we also got done a good bit of space. And yeah, maybe I'll get back to it, but we'll see. And I hope you enjoyed that. It was kind of fun revisiting it. Um, have a great day. Bye.